So DeMarcus Cousins is in trouble once again. Now, he's the kind of guy, man. You get up in his face, you piss him off. He may just punch you. He may just do it. Now, it doesn't matter if you're 10 feet or 5'1". You're not safe from DeMarcus Cousins. So a situation happened at a club, right? Now, allegedly, Matt Barnes, you know, the guy that uh, that choked out uh, Derek Fisher, because Derek Fisher was getting down with his wife and stuff around his kids. Matt Barnes ended up allegedly punching a woman at the club. You know, they chilling in the VIP. He punched a woman. Now, I don't know why he punched her. Maybe she got in his face. Maybe she put her hands in his face. Maybe she pushed him. He punched her. After that happened, the woman's husband tried to rush over there. DeMarcus Cousins allegedly sucker punched him. The reports say so someone of the media decided to write a report on this situation right now demarcus cousins got into it with the guy he got upset because allegedly the reporter should have never mentioned his family member so i'm gonna play you guys this video then i'm gonna break down the situation even further Finish. don't ever mention my brother again you don't know my f***ing brother okay that's good f coward Whatever the f you want to say about me, don't mention my family. So as you guys saw there, man, Demarcus Cousins like just went completely off. Now, of course, I don't think he was gonna punch the guy or anything like that. You know, some people are all emotional and stuff, or, and they're saying, "Oh, he, oh, he went after this old man." Like I understand. Listen, Demarcus is the kind of guy. It doesn't matter if you're young or old. You piss him off, you can get it. Now, he wasn't going to hit the guy because, of course, he didn't do it. I have a problem with DeMarcus Cousins because I wanted to defend him so bad once I heard that the old man did write about his, his family members. I'm like, you know, what did he say about them? Like, did he blame the family for DeMarcus' actions in life? Did he do that? Because... If he did, then I can understand why DeMarcus Cousins will be mad, right? Like, if you go out and you commit a crime, right? And I'm like, oh, man, his parents didn't raise him well. Oh, his freaking mom is horrible. If I start saying things like that, I can understand why someone would get upset, right? This is what the author had to say. For Cousins, this is his second late night outing on the club circuit. This year, that ended badly. In May, TMZ caught him at the drunk, I don't even know how that's pronounced or what they want to go with that, in Tampa with his younger brother, Jalel. The Celebrity Gossip website reported that he and his brother were trying to get into the club's DJ area. Jalel wound up shocked with a taser and arrested while friends hustled DeMarcus out of the place. Now, let me ask you this. DeMarcus, why are you upset if that's what happened. Now, listen, if you and your brother, right, were in a situation where he got shocked and arrested, that's fair game for this man to report about. Like I gave the, the analogy earlier, I can understand if he says something about your parents being horrible parents and not raising you well. I can understand if he would have said things like that of why you would be upset. There's no reason for you to be upset. You and your bonehead brother allegedly got in trouble he was arrested allegedly by tmz reports which tmz when it comes to someone getting arrested they're gonna get that correct but i'm just saying allegedly because i don't want to get sued so if that's really what happened how could you be upset at this man for reporting that i don't get it it just seems like you wanted to be outraged but you just use that as a reason to really mask your outrage. I don't know what happened at that club that night. I doubt Matt Barnes just hit that lady for no reason. I think she most likely put her hands on him, maybe pushed him, maybe put her hands in his face, did something for him to hit her. Now, you sucker punching the guy, allegedly. I'm sure you hit that guy to, you know, protect Matt Barnes. So, you know, I don't really know what happened in that situation, but I can understand how it may have went down. You're wrong in this situation. You can't get mad for a reporter reporting news that happened. You can't do that. If TMZ reports something and he's just quoting what TMZ said, go get mad at TMZ. And this is what I don't understand, man. 
people like this guy and other people like that, they always get mad at the little guy. Go get upset at TMZ. Why aren't you lashing out at what TMZ reported, right? So TMZ, I'm sure, reported that, right? Because he's quoting from them. Why aren't you running up on Harvey? Why are you getting mad at this guy? Oh, you getting mad at this guy because he's had some negative articles to write about you in the past. That's why you're upset, right? Anyway, you guys let me know what you think about this in the comment section below. I'm out.